Bro, they are flying through this. Wait a minute. Middle. That's it, my boy. You made it. Yo. <laughs> What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another reaction video. Today, we're going to be reacting to the new Pokemon Direct that just dropped. I'm only going to give you guys highlights of what I react to really strongly in the video, and then I'm going to give you some of my thoughts afterwards. So, without any further delay, let's get to it. Welcome to the Pokemon Direct. Oh, I'm thanks, Ishihara bro. From the Pokemon Company. What's up, Ishihara? Mm. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. <clears throat> Anytime you see dialogue box, you know it's Mystery Dungeon, bruh. <laughs> you know it's Mystery Dungeon, bruh. Art style is kind of cool, I'm not gonna lie. On Mystery Dungeon, Rescue Team DX. DX. I kind of like the art style of it, I'm not gonna lie. It's, I mean, it's whatever though. I've never actually played one. I've seen a lot of playthroughs. Um, I could give it a try, I haven't tried it out yet. But they're usually not for me. I like the storylines. Storylines are actually kind of decent in them. So, bro, I'm bothered. I'm bothered already. Pokemon Mystery Yo, Dungeon. I don't get it. Rescue I don't get it, man. DX. Between Pokemon Masters and Mystery Dungeon, bro, we get Megas, okay? I actually like the idea of Megas. Years since Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. They put Megas in everything except for the main series games now. Okay. For the Nintendo they had a Pokemon demo, maybe I try it out. Team but I'm I'm cool, bro. Will be released March 6, 2020. Damn, that comes out soon, low key. That's not even that long. It's not bad. We'll release a demo version on Nintendo eShop, available later today. <laughs> well, there goes what I just You'll be able said. to carry over your save date. <laughs> Mr. Masuda, Mr. Omori. This this is what we're here for right here, bro. This is it. We did our best to fill these titles with fun activities so that our players could have a fulfilling experience. They just lied. They just lied to us. They didn't try their best. Stop it. Eh, I'm not gonna lie. They probably did. I think. I think it was. I believe it was a time crunch. But whatever. Yeah, I died. Let me. I digress. Pokemon Shield expansion pass. What is this? Expansions for the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games that will be available for purchase from Nintendo eShop. Okay. Games. Are they serious right now? Just Pokemon Platinum version or Pokemon Ultra Sun and I'll Pokemon save my Ultimate. thoughts for the end of it. I I want to react first and then I don't want to stop the video. We'll just, just keep rolling. Those games. You'll Bruh. Be able to set out on new adventures using Bruh. The you're already playing. This, this, I've wanted this for so long. This is Okay, let me we'll just keep watching. <laughs> Everything's the same. Oh, they're just probably recapping. I may try to pause it if I see something that stands out a little bit, but everything is the same. They're just recapping. Our adventure. Saw it already. Saw it already. Yeah, you go back. All right, well, well, I'm gonna try not to stop it too much, bro. But please tell me if there's leaks that that showed the Reggie Rocks. Somebody, please. It, I don't. I I could be out of touch, but I don't remember seeing any leak. What the hell is that in the bottom left? What is that? Uh, I don't know if my webcam's over. We're gonna talk about it. We're gonna talk about it. Maybe they'll show it anyway. Cause they're tell they're doing it. They're doing it, people. They are doing it. I'm I'm cool, bro. I'm cool already, bro. Just show me what we getting. Please tell me my boy's gonna be in there, man. So I got like a god squad I play with him competitively. I've been swapping mines in and out of it, bro. But I just want my old squad still. Bro, there's so many designs. There's there's a lot going on. That's not a regular slowpoke, bro. Wait a minute. Are these gym leaders? Is this the minor gems they were talking about? So they, so the minor gems were a thing? Are these the same protagonists or different ones? Or is this hairstyle stuff? That's all it is. Okay. Okay, just hairstyles. I'm like, what? We get an expansion with new protagonists? What? Bro, that's another gym leader. Bro, I think the minor gems are actually a thing. Volcarona, yes, they're, yes, yes, that's what I'm talking about. We knew they were in the game. Bro, what is that? What is that? Bro, that's clean. They're showing the starters. They must be getting giant, uh, yup. They're getting G-Max forms too. Okay. What, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Yo, he was on the sniper tower. Look, he, that was kind of clean. Okay, this. Okay, Game Freak. I fucks with it now. 
I'm, I'm, I'm down with it now. I'm with the shits now, bro. I'm with it now. I'm with it now. This is a new direction now. Okay. I'm cool with this, bro. What's this? He's a... Uh, not a gym leader. He's something and we're like going on an adventure. What is that? Oh, the Reggie Rocks. Okay. Okay, that's where we get the, the rocks at. So, is Reggie Gigas in here? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Bro, they're getting forms? Bro, they are flying through this. Wait a minute. No, no. That's it, my boy. You made it. Yo. <laughs> my man. What? Bro, so now that, that's the that's the new wave now? Would you give legends forms? Bro, I need to know the typings ASAP. It was like it was fire ghost ele electric fire. What the hell? Bruh! Oh my That's what I'm talking about, bro. That's lit, bro. What what else are y'all giving up? Who the fuck is that? Bro, we gonna put the paws on somebody. Reminds me of the last legend. It's just the same. Are these two Pokemon they're showing us? Yeah, they're showing us two. What the f Bruh. They really like their like furry, like humanoids. You know what I mean? Bruh! So you're adding three legendaries to the game too? What did you think of this first look? The Pokemon Sword Expansion Pass and the Pokemon Shield Expansion Bruh, Pass this is lit! Of the Isle of Armor, planned to be released June. Bruh, wait a minute! They lied to us again! <laughs> wait, let's just, let's just keep going. I'll talk about it later. Bruh! And the Crown Tundra, planned to be released in Fall 2020. That's not bad! If you this is year Pokemon one Sword or Pokemon Shield expansion pass, you'll be able to enjoy both as they're released. Is this the new wave? One for Pokemon Shield. Uh. One will appear in the different versions, and you'll also run into some different people and places. We're hoping uh. to continue with the classic Pokemon experience of trading with one another. And Y'all just had together. to do it. Y'all fucked me now, up on that. Further ado, let's have the director himself present more information on the. We'll talk about it in a second, bro. The Crown Tundra. We'll talk about it in a second, bro. That's, that's that's kind of BS. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's BS. Making a damn expansion, but I don't get all the. Th oh my god. I understand the Pokemon deal, but no, bro. Don't make I'm it. Tani, whatever. Whatever. It's not terrible, but it's not the best, bro. I'm working as the director for the. This is clean. They build the hype themselves, bro. Are getting the Isle of Armor. The Isle of Omar. This. That's crazy. They're Cub Fu. What? It's a fighting type Pokemon that strives to become stronger with single-minded dedication. As Yo, Kung Fu is training, clean! Mustard will and Urshifu. Urshifu. Yo! Pokemon with two distinct styles. There is Single Strike Style. A fighting and dark type style that delivers a single strike at blinding speed. That is clean! There is also Rapid Strike Style. A fighting and water type style that focuses on unleashing a torrent of rapid strikes. That's so weird! What's more, the typings are throwing me off, but bro, it's clean. With a Pokemon you team up with in the gallery. Oh my god, that's whatever. Your adventure in the Isle of I really don't like you that one too much. That's to clean though. Gigantamax. I mess with that. You can look forward for your bike. Bro, that's a lot, bro. The white is clean. The new experience is coming in the Isle of Armor. See, I like how they showed Blastoise and Venusaur. Like, we knew y'all knew about them, so we're just going to shut up and not even talk about them. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. Bro, if this is the wave, I'm down. The information we have at the moment. If this is the wave, we're talking about like a new expansion every year for a couple years, like extending the game out. I'm down. Take a look for yourself at the beautiful I'll take that. scenery of the Shigala region. Before wait, 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 wait! They show Garchomp fitting right in with this area's theme. Is Garchomp gonna have a, a Galarian form? Produce Calyrex. That's cool. Every Pokemon you'll discover during your adventure. I thought that thing was upside down when I first saw it. Pokemon one co-op play as well. Okay, game free. To enter into legendary Pokemon. Okay. In the Crown Tundra. Okay. Including one. The Tapus, baby. Let's go. 
Are they all there? That some brand new legendary Pokemon are also bro, that's so clean that he has the Charizard the skull as a shield, bro. And the we wild area was low key. About them in future news reports, so please stay tuned. Low key was kind of big already, bro. Like, it wasn't massive, and there wasn't like a crap ton of stuff in it, bro. What do you think? But they're like, nah, we're gonna make another area even Game bigger, bro. Freak are all working hard to including the Bruh! Listen! Y'all are not <laughs> Bruh. We'll be distributing We were all asleep on them. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield that will coincide with the releases of the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra. We were asleep on them. These updates will allow people who don't have the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield expansion pass to obtain the Pokemon that appear on the Isle of Armor and in the Crown Tundra through other means, such as trading. Bro, we were sleep on them, bro. I apologize for the bullshit that I I apologize for any bullshit I missed. I wasn't talking bad shit, bro. But I'm a little I, I'm with y'all, bro. I'm with y'all now. Pokemon Home is planned to launch in February 2020. Home comes out so soon. We intend to release even more details before then, so please wait just a little bit longer. Bruh. Where's my Finally, wallet at? We have some more new Clara. Okay. Pokemon Shield, you'll run into Ava. Yo, okay. Your shorts are a little too high for me. Valerian Slowpoke that's wandered in from the Isle of Armor. Okay. You can try out. That's fine. That's why I didn't what speak on it cuz that motherfucker in the game now. Today, we've finally been able to Bruh. show some of what we had How much is home though? For you want me to drop 30 on that, bro? I'm cool. Awesome. All right. That was I'm not going to lie to you. That was a lot a lot of information they threw out. I did not expect for them to go into like a quote unquote expansion, which still low key is blowing my mind that we're actually in an expansion. I'm gonna start by saying this. If you're upset because we're getting an expansion DLC, then you are a fool, my guy. And <laughs> listen, I know everybody has their, their own opinion, whatever, but I will have to, I, I have to say this, bro. Every single year, they made us pay for a third title. That third title gave us another legendary and it maybe changed the story just a little bit like a couple cutscenes. that was it that i mean the close thing we got the sequels were black and white too to where it was kind of everything was different but other than that we really didn't get much so you literally paid the same price for another game in order to do this this however is an expansion pass so it's essentially like having a third version of the game but instead of them just running through the same story they're just giving us more content i'm i'm cool now, regardless, you can say, ooh, Game Freak did this on purpose to make us pay for DLC for old Pokemon. So, <laughs> I mean, it's whatever at this point. Like, I'm not, like, I feel like that's nitpicking. You know what I mean? Like, they made us pay for the game, and now they're making us pay for other Pokemon DLC. But they're not. They showed it to where you can go ahead and, and trade them away if you don't have the DLC. So it's not like they're, they're trying to ring in money. I legit think that they had an issue with the models, and they're gonna put them back in the game when they have time to do that. And we're seeing that right now. They they added 200 old Pokemon in the pack. Like, bruh, the, what? How many more we're missing now? Like 200 and something left. Like they they they're adding half the Pokemon back in, and they're adding new forms. Like they're they're giving us so much more. Okay, all right. I didn't want to start talking about the past yet, but I started talking about it. But regardless, though, they started off the direct with the Mystery Dungeon. I'm not a big fan of Mystery Dungeon. I've actually watched people play through it. It's not something I'm gonna play, regardless, I got the demo. So now I have to, like, I feel like I have to try it out now. Um, and like I said, I've all, the, the couple that I've seen before people play, I've actually actually liked the story. I'm like, it was it was interesting. So we'll see how that goes. But I'm not really too interested in it. Um, and it, it blows my mind that they actually had time to do that. Like, the, the amount of stuff that they're working on right now, like it, it, like I said, it kind of blows me away here. Cause remember, this game hasn't been out forever, and they they already have solid content coming to us. Now it's still left to be seen. Like the region could be kind of short, or the the story could be really short, and they're just adding Pokemon essentially. But regardless, it's it's something more than we've had in the past, and I'm okay to be hype about that. Which, which is another thing too, Loki, they lied to our asses. They said we have no plans for DLC or nothing. Bro, they've been doing that from the jump. They have been trying to be as quiet about this game as possible so they can reveal the hypeness. I could be out of the loop. I haven't heard any, you know, Pokemon uh, YouTubers talking about leaks and everything else since the game has come out. There may have been people on there talking about it, but regardless, I have, it, like, it hasn't got pushed in front of my face. I haven't seen anything about it. And I, I am so glad I was able to be surprised by this. 
yes, we knew about the 30 Pokemon that were data mined, but the rest of them, bro, no, nobody had any clue about this, I don't think. At least, you know, there wasn't people talking about it. There was so much in this, bro. There, it's, there's so much. And I, 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 I'm so lost right now, to be honest with you. Like, I cannot believe that they're not only adding new forms, two new areas, new G-Max mons, old or like new um new galarian forms of legendaries but they're adding 200 more pokemon in they're giving us new characters new story i like i said bro i my mind is blown right now about all this and i i am really looking forward to like like actually getting my hands on it i'll be honest with you here like all these games to me they were trash sorry phone call coming in they were trash like they all were like, uh, like, yes, like they give the third version of the game, but we liked the game originally. It really didn't do much for you. You just encountered the third legendary. Boom, bam, thank you, ma'am. Game's over with. You know what I'm saying? But like, this is massive, bro. Like, this is massive. Like, there's so much going on. And I, I just really like, <laughs> bro, look at these forms, man. So this looks like it's either fire dark, I'm assuming. Um... And then the other two look, they were like Articuno, maybe it was like Fire or Ice Psychic. And then Zapdos, I swear, looked like it was um, Zapdos looked like it was, um, oh, what's it called? Electric and like Fire or something like that. I don't know, bro. I don't know. But it, it's a lot going on, bro. And I'm, I'm just, I'm surprised at all of it, to be honest with you. Um, and like I said, they didn't even hint on the ones that were being data mined. They're kind of doing how they did the ultra wormhole and the fact that they're giving us these dens that we can go back and find all the legends in bro. There, there's so much that they gave us in the expansion pass. Like I said, it, it's 30 bucks too. Like they're giving us two solid expansions. So if you want to think about it, they gave an expansion pass, you know, 15 bucks a, a pop. I'm cool with that. That's not ridiculous. They don't make us pay another $60 for a third version of the game. It's pay half. Get over 200 mons, more forms, and two new areas. I'm cool with that. If this is the, the plan for then, like, 2021, is here's two more areas and here's the rest of your Pokemon. I'm cool with that. So they have a team working on DLCs and they have a team getting ready for the next game. Or maybe, you know, ex you know the, the reboots. Now, I'm going to lie to you, bro. This legend's clean, my guy. And so what? The only one, only one that we've had evolved before was um, uh, Nebby. I'm forgetting its actual name, um, but yeah, we have another legend that that evolves. Like this is, I guess it's wild, bro. Like and it has two forms. I'm not quite sure about their typings, to be honest with you. I think it's weird to have a fighting dark and a fighting water. What? But regardless, though, like they're clean. I didn't realize those were uh, G Max forms beforehand, but they're clean. So I, I I'm looking forward to seeing what this mod is like. Um, and then, oh yeah, let, let's 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 talk about this. So tutor moves including all new moves which i don't i don't know what that means i don't mean if they're bringing back like hidden power and stuff question mark um they have more app uh apricorns so i don't know if those are new ball types or they're just they're giving us the rest of them and then experience charm so i don't i guess i'm not sure what that is maybe it says earn more exp like how how much more do we need <laughs> like that's a lot so i don't know if the exp charm then takes over for the experience share and you turn it on and off. I don't, if they did that, bro, then like they actually listen to people. I doubt they do that though. Like the experience charm, here's the experience charm. You actually turn it off and get no experience share. I, that would be kind of wild if they did that. That would be dope. But I, I'm, I'm not sure what the case may be with that. But they, they hinted at a lot in this. They talk about a mysterious tree. And then, like I said, the second area, you explore dens now with act like it sounds like it's an actual co op mode. It might not be. But they made it like it's an actual co-op mode. So, like, you know, for example, in the wild area right now, you don't get to, like, actually run around with your friends. You're just in an online server, and it's just, like, you know, people running around next to you. This sounds like it almost could be, like, no, your, joint, your friend joins into your session, and you guys run around in dens together, which it probably still isn't. Let's just be honest. You probably connect to a den and invite them. But regardless, forward thinking, that sounds pretty cool. And they're hinting at so much mystery stuff. They're still leaving stuff up for debate and everything else, bro. Like, I am stupid excited for this expansion pass bro like it's gonna be ridiculous like what they're adding and and what they decide to do like i am i am down for all this bro and my man Garchomp made it in the game bro i'm 
Man, dude. So it's like I said, a lot of what we heard is past rumors don't seem to be necessarily true. Um, not not all of them. I'm talking about like as far as like maybe the minor attempts. It didn't sound like it was a thing as they they were talking about it. Uh, we saw 30 new Pokemon. Psych, <laughs> bitch, it's more. <laughs> so it's it's gonna be crazy. Home comes out soon, so some of the OGs get to make it. They put out some of the G Max forms. They put Slowpoke glaring in the game. Like, bro, like if this was what Game Freak was talking about their new direction, which I think it is. I think it was saying, hey, instead of charging just for a bogus third version, let's just make DLC and pump out more content. I'm down. If this DLC was just, hey guys, here's your other 200 mods that you wanted. That would, I would, that would be kind of bogus. But you see them actually adding new content. The meta is gonna constantly keep changing. That's what I like. Like that. That's what I like about it. So before it was, I gave you all the Pokemon, you're just gonna use your old ones. It's like, no, get used to these new ones. Here's the next 200, because not all of them you're gonna use competitively. Here's the next 200, swap them in and out. And then here's the rest of them. So by the time the rest of them come out, it's either, ah, I'll use them or, nah, I'm actually, I like these replacements better. So I'm, the meta's constantly gonna be changing. Definitely if they, they give different stat buffs and they give new move sets and stuff, like that's what I'm saying. Like it's gonna keep changing and evolving. So it's gonna keep, competitive fresh bro i'm i'm down with everything that they're doing right now i know pokemon's not really competitive but still you know what i mean regardless though bro i'm bro i can't believe that they gave us this heat my guy <laughs> there was so much and I, I was expecting to hear about home and sleep they just they just mentioned home and that was it oh, home's coming out don't worry about it anyway regardless so let me show you these fire new minds that we've been cooking up <laughs> bro i i'm I'm stupid excited for everything that's gonna happen, bro. I, 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 my mind is still trying to like wrap my head around. They gave us 20 minutes actual, like actual content. You know what I mean? Like they didn't just give us nothingness. Like they gave us, oh, here's two expansions. It's only gonna cost you 30 bucks, but here's all the shit you get to do in it. Like I'm, I'm down, bro. That, if this is the future, bro, I'm down. And that is gonna do it for us, man. I know I ranted a little bit. I know the reaction might have been a little short, but. There, there was just a lot I wanted to get off my chest about all that, man. But like I said, it's it seems like it's gonna be worth it. Regardless, so I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Until next time, though. Oh, I'm out of here.